Hello guys, welcome once again back to my channel. This is Shades of Madi. So for this, I've be uh, I, I've, I designed just a simulation, just a very simple design. I got this image online and I decided to work on it. So it's very very simple. So what I did at first was to bring in my image. I'll be dropping this file in the in the link below. So what I did was to bring in my image. Let me press Ctrl N for new. My page size is one zero zero by one thirty fifty for create. So let me bring in my image now. Just see. Control V. So what I did here, very simple, was to just create a Gaussian blur effect to this to this um, background with a radius of ten. If you don't know how to go to Google, your Gaussian blur, come to filter blur Gaussian blur. You can see, very simple. Filter blur Gaussian blur. Then I added. So I added this image, this background here. I changed the blend mode to overlay. You can see, you can work anyhow. I wanted to add life to the. To the background so if i see if i switch off you can see it looks kind of dull so i want to have light to the background so i i changed the blend mode to overlay so you can ignore this one i was walking around them to see how to turn out so you can ignore these ones then as you can see i love using light a lot you know because it's i'm used to it it's kind of brightening up my images so i place the light behind behind the images i place the light behind the images uh, sorry behind the image rather so this is the image i brought in as a png file let's check out the camera roll um editing that into it sorry it's loading sorry i think i've opened too many tabs on my system so it's taking a while to load so for the basic now i use exposure at fee at 0 0.50 contrast at 64 texture at 64 clarity at 64 uh, clarity at 34 rather i think okay i didn't add any detail to it no i didn't see my image my image popped so you can do well to you know do it any way you want so you can see that if i turn off these lights now you can see everything is going to look dark behind so what I, you can see so i now i added light behind the image then i brought in one of the lights i, I added it you can see see the light here just one of the light you can add it behind this very simple then last but not the least on all my layers what i do is sorry it's not the last one rather what i do is is create a gradient tool effect how do i do this i come to my box here new layer i call with my foreground color set to black i click on my gradient tool here you can see at 100 percent opacity i gently drag very simple it's very simple so you can drag it again it's very simple so what i did again okay for okay let's see this test come to the text so i, I used okay as usual i try to simulate a 3d effect so i duplicate my text with i use the font sugar bomb regular color as usual a to zero f zero zero for the text behind and uh, for the text behind so and let's check our fx to see what i did again in the fx Bevel and embossed. I use inner bevel, smooth, depth 100, direction up, size 16, start from 0, then contour 100, then drop shadow. Oh, sorry, drop shadow 100, distance 7, spread 4, size 38, noise 0 for the text behind. So I use the font sugar bump regular again size 40 so i wanted to have this 
gold kind of feel so i brought in this image this gold image and i created a clipping mask let me release the clipping mask you see that the image is like this so you you bring the image now you now right click and create clipping mask it will work on the first image the image on top you can see it's clipping to this text it's very very simple so for this re uh, rectangle here you can see i added bevel and emboss color red so i added i added inner bevel smooth depth for the 3 size 13 soften 9 you can see the settings i used here it's very simple so if you, uh, the same thing i i did i applied to this to the same thing i applied it, i applied it to, to this one too. so it's very very simple so please if you have any question please do well to ask, ask me in the comment section i will be dropping the psd file also to this design so you can you can use it for your jobs so please thank you for watching my video please do subscribe and watch, and watch my other videos thank you